Comelec Commissioner Rowena Guanzon accuses Commissioner Aimee Ferrodino of deliberately delaying the vote to a disqualification case against presidential aspirant Bongbong Marcos Jr. The case is pending before the Commission on Elections First Division, where Ferrodino, Guanzon, and Marlon Casquejo sit as presiding judges. Guanzon caused a stir when she publicized her vote on the disqualification case against Marcos pending before the First Division. She notes the ponente, or writer of the ruling, Commissioner Ferrolino, has become incomunicado. Intentionally, hindi niya ilalabas dahil alam niya na yung boto ko, thank you. Para hindi na makount yung boto ko. It's a full uh, intent to delay the resolution para hindi na makount yung boto ko. Ang Commissioner uh, Ferrolino, unfortunately, is not observing collegial courtesy and has disrespected me as her senior Commissioner and presiding commissioner. Ito ang biktima dito ang taong bayan. Dahil it's in the interest of everybody na matapos natin ang DQ cases sa Supreme Court sa madaling panahon. Guanzon says she was compelled to publicize her vote because she feels the division has already lapsed its deadline. Guanzon, who is set to retire on February 2, also hints that a politician is allegedly trying to delay the resolution. Guanzon says the evidence is clear that Marcos should be disqualified on the grounds of moral turpitude. She adds it's a ground for disqualification under Section 12 of the Omnibus Election Code. Masama po ba o tama po ba na hindi nagbayad ng buwis apat na taon ang gobernador uh, habang ang kanyang ama ay presidente? Ang sagot ko po ay hindi po tama yan. Masama po yan. Kaya po moral turpitude yan. Meantime, Partido Federal ng Pilipinas condemns Guanzo on Friday, January 28, a day after she disclosed her vote to disqualify Marcos in the 2022 presidential race. In a statement, PFP General Counsel George Briones says Guanzo should be disbarred for her premature disclosure of her unpromulgated dissenting opinion on Marcos' disqualification case. Briones also calls Guanzo an incorrigible narcissist with an insatiable craving for posting on social media like Twitter, which is not proper for a judge.